Greetings, Earthling. I'm going to blow up the world with my super intergalactic space missile. Hey guys, it's Robin, and today I have two of my favorite, all-time favorite aliens here with me in Funko Pop form. I cannot believe they've made Marvin the Martian. Um, I also have Marvin. I just said that. I have Marvin. But I also have K-9. And I have the Porky Pig Space Cadet. I did not yet get the Duck Dodgers. I haven't seen him. Um, I got these at a really cool store called Couch Potato. There's a Couch Potato Entertainment Store at the Nyack Palisade Center Mall. on South Grover. Now, I was, I was, in a recent video, I was like, Count, I don't know if I have your friend Grover yet. And I did have him. He was like right on the floor when I was opening it. I just forgot he was there. Also, I have this awesome Hot Topic exclusive Doug. And he's locked. And that is so cool. I'm up. And I got him at, oh, Hot Topic. He's a Hot Topic exclusive. I'm really losing it today, guys. And I also have Dagobah Yoda, who looks a little bit older than the younger Yoda. Um, oh, I have him over there, so maybe I'll show you guys what he looks like. I'm really excited about all these pops. Um, Doug looks so cute. I love... I think they made an earlier version of Doug. Um, maybe not. I don't know, but they also made one with the Cohen of Shame. That's just so funny. Um, I'm not sure if they made an earlier one in the Disney series, but I do not have him. But I do have Russell and Carl, so it's very cool to have Doug. The talking dog. Squirrel! What? What? Doug. Um, oh, it would be really cool to have a photo shoot with him and Squirrel Girl, don't you think? That would be awesome. He is flocked, which I just think makes him so cute. Oh my gosh. I love him. He's adorable. Um, he is just so cute. The only bad thing about flocked pops is I do like to keep them in their boxes. I don't know. I think they just get a little funky and dusty if you don't. And I don't like to keep my pops in their boxes. Like this one, Grover. Get out of there, Grover. Free Grover. Um, there are some really awesome Sesame Street characters. So I do have them all now, and I'm really excited about that. Like, I have Snuffy in the flock version, and he lives in his box, too. <laughs> Poor pops who live in their boxes. He is just so cute and blue. I love him. He is one of my favorite, favorite monsters. Grover, you're awesome. Grover, I mean, Grover helped me learn how to count and read and all that stuff. I'm sure he helped lots of you guys, too. When I was a kid, Elmo wasn't around yet, so we had Grover. <laughs> he was just so cool. I love him. So here is the older um, release of Yoda, and he has the lightsaber. And it never occurred to me that he's more of, um, you know, a Phantom Menace or actually the second movie. What's the one, the second one where Yoda fights? Um... Attack of the Clones, Yoda. Never occurred to me until I saw that they made Dagobah Yoda, which is more of a classic Yoda from like Empire Strikes Back, which I'm kind of glad they made him in this style. Although I do think that this other Yoda is adorable. But this really looks like Yoda. Oh, and you know what? These guys are both Muppets. <laughs> in the first, in the original... Yoda, you know, he was created by the Creature Shop, I think, and he's voiced by Frank Oz. I think Jim Henson voices um, Grover, though, or originally. So this is so cool. He's got all this, like, gray hair and wrinkles. And he's got his robes, and he has a staff, and he does not have the lightsaber. And I just think that is so cool. His coloring is also a little bit lighter. And, ugh, this Yoda's kind of dirty. <laughs> his eyes are darker. And he just looks older and wiser, don't you think? <laughs> I just think that is so cool. I'm so excited about that. Oh, this Yoda needs some, uh, needs a bath. <laughs> oh, poor Yoda. And so, these next pops, I'm just really super excited about. Marvin the Martian is just one of my all-time favorite, favorite cartoon characters. Um, when I was a kid... There was this Looney Tunes store, like they had the Disney store, but they had Looney Tunes store, so you could buy like a ton of Marvin stuff. And Marvin looks like he has a weird foot problem. Oh, he is not going to stand up. What is up with this? Man, he's all derpy. Oh no. I mean, this is not a good surface, but 
He doesn't have a stand, but his feet are all bent. I mean, he always looks kind of menacing like that. Anyway. No. Oh, no. He might have to stay in the box. Maybe I can bend him a little bit. Um, he's just really cool. I love the design on him. Oh, you know what? One year, my mom made me a Marvin the Martian costume. It was really cool. I don't have pictures of it, though. <laughs> it was before digital cameras, guys. I was in high school. Um, he's got that angry face, and he's like, Greetings, Earthling. I'm going to blow up the world with my super intergalactic space missile. Um, look at that. You can, you can dust things with his <laughs> top of his head there. Oh, and he's got his ray gun. He just looks so cool. And I love that little skirt that, like, sticks up. He kind of looks like a Roman centurion or something. He's just so cool. I love him. Oh, I'm, I'm kind of sad that he's a little bit derpy, though. It's okay. I will still love him the best. And here is his companion, K9. Oh, it's so cool. One day I should do a, um, a, a collection video of all my um, Marvin the Martian stuff that I have. I love him. He just, he looks really cute. The pose is really adorable. And I love all that green. And guys, do you know they're coming out with Funko Pop Pets series? And there's no pug? What's up with that? But he's cool. He also has the little... <laughs> I just always think that's so funny. Um, so yeah, Duck Dodgers in the, is it Duck Dodgers in the 21st century or something like that? Or the 25th century? Classic, classic Looney Tunes cartoon. And of course, you can probably know them from Space Jam and the other cartoons over the years. But it's so classic. And, and uh, here's Porky Pig, a space cadet. And he is just so cute, too. Oh my goodness, he's adorable. He's just, he's so cute. He's kind of little, too. Oh my gosh, he's like, that's, that's all, folks. Um, oh, he's so cute. I love him. Oh my gosh. This is, the, like, such a great little haul. I love, love Porky Pig here. And my derpy little Marvin. And K9. They're so cool. Just so, so excited about these guys. And then I also have Doug. And Grover. And Dago by Yoda. And I just think they're all really, really awesome. Mm, awesome, we are. So let me know which one of these guys is your favorite. Like I said, Marvin is probably my favorite thing. Where did I put Marvin? Because I just have such a special, you know, a special love of Marvin. He's just one of my favorites. But like I said, these are two of my favorite alien creatures ever. In one video. Oh my gosh. I love it. I hope you guys will like this video and subscribe and you can follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Thanks so much for watching and may the force be with you. <laughs> Bye. Be sure to check out some of our other videos and hit that subscribe button.